and got the build materials right here, some pictures of what I hope it's going to look like. Um, and then two pieces you can see at the bottom were too short, and then right there, had to make a profile repair. Started welding, and then I have four pieces already tack welded together, and then I uh, got most of the pieces pretty well uh, welded, and then uh got three or four of the back pieces on right now, and then I had the magnetic triangle to uh, weld them at a nice angle, and then um, starting the back rest already. Uh, tack welds again, and then angle 90 degrees. Um, just need to put on the legs, and then the seat. And then right there, you could see that I uh, had some bad welds, and then they're actually really bad. And then my, there's my backrest. I uh, cut notches out uh, to make it at an angle, and then I welded them together to make it comfortable, so you're not leaning forward video or my checkpoint video. Uh, I kind of forgot to do the other videos. Um, I'm just working on it. And first thing I'd like to point out is right here I cut the piece too short so then I had to find another scrap piece and do a profile repair to uh, make it the right length for my project. Um, another thing I'd like to point out is my welds. They're not consistent. Some of them are better than other ones, and um, uh, as you can see, it kind of wobbles here too. Um, and that's pretty much it. and sand it down the weld so you can't see the seam. Well, you can still see it a little bit, but I mean, probably could have done a little better job. Um, and then I still need to sand off all the mill scale on my project because I'm going with a clear coat uh, spray paint to make it shine. Um, and it's still wobbly, I need to fix that. And that's pretty much it. Alright, so this is my <laughs> checkpoint video for uh, Metal Tab. And this is my final project. Finished everything on it. Uh, just, instead of painting it color, I put on clear coat just because I wanted that shiny, kind of rustic look on it. And then I didn't quite get all the mill skills uh, send it off, just time consuming. Um, and then in the corners of the here, I actually borrowed some silver spray paint just to cover up some of the mistakes I had. Um, I didn't have time to fix the wobble on it, but I don't think that would be too much of a problem. And that's pretty much it. Okay, so one thing that I probably would have wanted to do differently is have this bar like on the outside just so I didn't have or I wouldn't have to uh, have the metal go around it and then um, I wouldn't want to have it rock but um, yeah and then uh, right here I'd uh, probably do a better weld right here and uh, make this piece longer, definitely, for sure. Um, and then, maybe I would have gone with a different color paint because uh, you can see a lot of the impurities on here, like um, the uh, sanding and everything, the, like when it, the metal burns from being too hot, um, and then just some dust and everything on it that you can see.